I'm Erin Moore. I'm the Clinical Nutrition Manager at Washington Regional. I oversee the dietitians in the system as well as the infant nutrition lab staff. Washington Regional is the only hospital in this area with a centralized milk preparation room. So the Infant Nutrition Lab services babies mostly in the neonatal intensive care unit or the NICU. These babies when they're born prematurely or have medical conditions, it prevents them from being able to breastfeed in the first few weeks of life. So by having this milk preparation room, we're able to supply them with breast milk, whether mother's milk, donor milk, or fortified milk and formula, so that the baby can receive that through an alternate route. So if the baby needs extra nutrition for growth, we add fortifiers to the milk to help them to grow and develop while they're here in the NICU. We take the milk from the mothers and sometimes it's fresh or frozen. We measure it on gram scales to get the exact measurement. We also add fortifiers using a magnetic stir base. So the magnet spins and stirs the milk and the fortifiers to evenly mix it so that we don't have to manipulate or shake the milk. We also draw it up into syringes using special tools so that we don't waste any milk. And we have a special bead bath that helps us to thaw milk um, without using water. So there's an antimicrobial process for thawing the milk. Our infant nutrition lab uses a breast milk scanning system that helps track the milk or the formula from the time that the mother drops it off to the time that it reaches the baby. This ensures that the right feeding reaches the right baby. This is in place to help us with quality and safety measures. It also helps us to ensure that we have a proper recipe that's calculated appropriately for the infant's feeding order. We also receive donor milk for babies whose mothers are unable to provide milk for whatever reason. The donor milk comes from different donor institutions or donor milk banks throughout the country. And we take that milk, which is pasteurized, and use it for those babies. We specifically order from Oklahoma Mother's Milk Bank and we have become a new depot site for them, meaning that mothers in our area who decide to donate milk to the Oklahoma Mother's Milk Bank can drop it off here so that we can get it to the milk bank. This milk in turn will provide milk to babies and NICUs across the country that need this specialized type of feeding.